Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be doing something uh, a little different. I don't think I ever did a video on this. Um, I'm going to be showing you how I do a zip up hoodie. Uh, I know there's other videos out there, but I'm going to show people basically with a heat press where I can't change out the platen. I don't have different platen change outs. So I'm just going to do, uh, you know, on my regular standard heat press, uh, 15 by 15 from Heat Press Nation. And I'm gonna do because you have to watch for the zipper and everything like that. I'm not gonna do a full print. I'm just gonna do the the left chest. I'm gonna do a back hit on it because also with these the hood hangs down a little bit farther than your regular hoodie. I personally like wearing hoodies, so that's why I'm always doing hoodies and stuff. But when you unzip it, your hood's gonna hang down a little bit lower. So I'm gonna go a little bit lower with the print on the back than I normally would. So I'm gonna get the heat press heated up and then get right into pressing this zip up hoodie up. All right, so basically why this is still heating up, uh, I'm using TKO transfers, uh, uh, they're single color. I'll show you guys in a second. So the trick that I do with this heat press, I put this over it completely. I put it on there just like a hoodie. I'm, I actually bought, moved the camera back to try to get better clips for you guys. So my zipper's right here. I don't want my zipper in there, but obviously I'm gonna have a little bit of my zipper in there. So I'm gonna get this all up under here so I can close it and everything. All right. So you basically wanna line it up. It's gonna be almost the same thing as a hoodie. So I'm gonna use my uh, Teflon pillow. I'm gonna shove it in here. Basically right around the area. So that way the zipper's down and it's popping it up from this, from the pocket seam. Let me line this all up here. Get my lip roller. I'm just gonna lip roll the area I'm doing real good. And uh, the Teflon pedals, I'll put them in the description, but you could get them on uh, Amazon. I got them really cheap. Just make sure I'm all centered here. Now there's other people doing different ways. This is the way that I found uh, when I was messing around easier for me to do it. And then same thing. So you're going to go from where the seam of the hoodie meets with the hood straight down. So you're going to be about, about an inch over from, in, from the pocket. So you should be lined up like right here, right up the center with it. And that's going to be your center point right there. So. Let me just give this a free press, make sure it's, I gotta loosen it up a little bit. Cause you want heavy pressure with these. Okay. Line that up there. Make sure I'm pretty much centered here. All right, let me get my transfer. Use my front hit, and there's no cover sheet on these. So I'm gonna line it up here. Put my seam up. Make sure I'm centered with it. Yeah, just a little bit with it. If you have to, you could slide the pillow over with it. It's still a little high up here, so I'm gonna pull this down a little bit. Just don't want to get my zipper in it. Any time when you're trying stuff like this, you could always, you know, take your time when you're first doing something. Make sure I'm lined up here. Thank you. 
Put a fourth finish down. I want to go up a little bit higher with these. Should be good right there. We're going about four fingers down. And then, like I said, that's my center. Center eye, you always want your left chest a little bit over, so center up whatever uh, center, the chest logo you have so you can figure out everyone's gonna be different where they're going. That should be good there. See my heat presses up the tent when I get my heat going. Right where we need to be at. These are hot peel. Got my zipper out right here. I always let my press go for about a second more. There we go. Nothing left. Off here. All right, let me get the back set up. All right, guys, so same thing. I'm gonna slide it over. This is actually, this is how I do my hoodies. And I'm not gonna need the, the Teflon pellet for this. And like I said, there's everybody out there who's got their own way they do stuff. This is how I do it. Just a quick video. Now I'm gonna have to tighten this up. Because now I'm down with it. See your hood when you unzip it it's gonna go down a little farther so usually i go about four inches down when my back hits that's how i do it personally so this one i'm gonna probably go not too much i might just go like four and a half These are TKO transfers. I'm going from the top of where my print is, right from the seam of the hood. Now my other hoodies, since the hood stays up, I don't go too far out with them. Center. Check my temp here. Where we need to be at. Heavy pressure, and it's for uh, 10 seconds. I think I said seven to 10. At 325. Well, 300, 325. I go the highest with it. I'll hold this up at the end for you guys. Okay, so there you go, guys. Zip up hoodie. Uh, I wanted to make this video. I know I, you know, I never made a video on zip up hoodies, but this is just the way I'm showing you that people could do it without having a, a heat press, without you know, plat and change outs. That you can just do it with a regular heat press. Just get the Teflon pillows. They're on Amazon. They're real cheap. And that way you could offer people and say, hey, I do zip up hoodies too. Let me get you back here. It's the back hit. The hood just goes over it. Once I'm wearing it, the hood will be up. But there you go. That's just a quick video on it. Um, and also my next video, I am doing the giveaway in the next video. And then I'm going to run it for probably about 
uh, probably about a month. So, you know, everybody could get involved with it. So get subscribed to the channel. That's the only way you're going to win is because I'm giving it away to uh, a subscriber. I'm going to probably run a thing like, a, a, you know, an, a, a thing that'll go through like my subscribers and pick a random one. So that way it's fair. Um, so I just want to get that out there. Make sure you get a part of the giveaway. And um, if you guys would, like, comment, subscribe, and I'm going to keep coming out with some more of this t-shirt content. I'll catch you guys in the next one. All right, peace. Thank you.